I grew up fearful of the world. I always had this feeling like something bad was about to happen. My first time at a shelter, I was five. I just remember running down the street late at night. My mom had to get us out of the house and away from all the violence. We never went back home. When I was 18, my son was born, but I couldn't pay the rent. I was homeless again. But it wasn't just me who was trapped. Addiction was all around me growing up, so it was an easy escape. I realized that it would be the same thing all over again for my son if I didn't break the cycle. I started taking courses at night. Samantha wasn't really sure in terms of, yes, I know I need to go back to school, but where is that going to lead me? Then one of my teachers told me about Wee Day. I saw all these amazing young people doing so much and I felt so inspired. I started to believe that maybe I could do something too. And out of that grew Sam's idea of the bags for the needy. This was one of the care packages that we put together last year and of course that's sort of what we want to do again this year. Sam, this is kind of your baby. <laughs> and she's added a unique touch in each package, I put a little bit of sage to let them know that I understand their struggles. Sage cleanses your spirit from all the pain and negativity. It started with care packages, but the more I helped others, the more I started to feel like myself again. Like I had a sense of purpose in my life. I went to drumming circles, sweat lodges, vigils for people who are missing or gone. I've seen her talking about the hurt and the pain and the anger that she's felt. And I've seen her be able to forgive. She is becoming such a strong leader. I'd never thought about volunteering before we schools, but I feel like I'm at home in my community for the first time. 